potential global first for the anniversary. Let's talk about it. I will mention really quick, I am a little scared simply because I did say that if we hit 69K before the end of Global's anniversary, which takes place, you know, around mid-August-ish, I'll do face cam. And we just hit 61.1, and we're now on the cusp of 61.2. Y'all are going a little crazy. I really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I love each and every one of you. So thank you for the support. It's just, y'all go a little bit crazier than I thought you would. So let's keep it pushing if you guys want. And uh, for today's really quick challenge to test your luck and rng as it stands currently for the anniversary pick a side of the coin hurry up just do it quick hurry up pick a side of the coin don't make it complicated all right you got it perfect i'm gonna basically flip the coin if you get it right no push-ups today don't subscribe don't even like the video just sit back relax grab some snacks shout out to Corey. i say that every time he's the goat you know what it is however if you get it wrong means you got caught lacking today <laughs> Drop down, give me two. <laughs> and you got to subscribe to the channel. It is what it is. Let's flip the coin in three, two, one. Let's see what it lands. And it's tails. If you pick tails, GG's. If you picked heads, drop down, give me two. This is the only Dokkan channel that's getting you right physically for the anniversary, okay? All right, beautiful. And of course, you got to subscribe. It is what it is. Let's talk about this potential global first and why I'm even bringing this up. So, Dokkan... And JP Dokkan specifically released these two EZAs as part of the tail end of the anniversary celebration. And these two EZAs being Vegito, uh, S, uh, Super Vegito, right? Goku Vegito who fused into Super Vegito. And then, of course, the physical Tanks LR. These are worldwide download celebration LRs. They had absolutely no business getting an EZA during the anniversary celebration. I say that because usually anniversary will, you know, easy a Dokkan Fest here or there and even, you know, end up easy a specific anniversary characters. But we've never really seen worldwide download celebration headliners, at least from what I remember, easy a in the anniversary. And to give you an example of that, AGL Gohan and LR Cell easy a Pretty close to the anniversary, but only because this was a part two kind of content uh, for the you know, beastless Gohan and the orange pickle celebration that we got in uh, tw uh, late 2022. So just keep that in mind. We also had the, um, you know, worldwide download celebration characters as in the transforming Goku and transforming Frieza, but they easy aid during the normal worldwide download celebration time. So again, these guys really had no business easy aing when they did, which is what led me to make that video I made before Golden Week. I said, that these two getting an easy A and some other circumstances that took place led me to make a video saying, I think the Golden Week celebration, which is shared between Global and JP, should be Majin Buu Saga related. And it turns out I was right and many other people were right as well. So basically what happened is JP Dokkan got two easy A's that Global was going to get anyways in Golden Week, but they just got them a little early. So again, JP got two easy A's that we were going to get anyways during a shared celebration, which again was Golden Week, which takes place, you know, two months after JP Dokkan's anniversary ends. And we are right now in that same exact position, but for Global Dokkan. So Global Dokkan has this anniversary celebration. And at the end of Global's anniversary, which again is around August 9th, August 10th, a few weeks after that, around the 31st, maybe even the 27th, as early as that maybe, that's when the worldwide celebration begins. So it is not completely unplausible, or however you conjugate that word, it's not un implausible, I think that's the way you say it, to consider that in the slot where JP got these LRs, maybe Global can get Global first EZAs, and a few weeks later, JP gets them for the worldwide celebration. Remember that the Global and JP sync doesn't necessarily mean that everything is going to happen at the same exact time. Sometimes global will get global first content and then 
I guess this is a new phrase now, but JP will get JP first content, which comes to global a little bit later, right? So it just really depends on what version of the game you play will determine what you get access to first. But it's completely possible that we get some global first EZAs that then JP gets just a few weeks later, just like how JP got these two EZAs first that we ended up getting two months later. Now the question then turns into, okay, so what characters could we see get an EZA first on global? And... Of course, if we're going to follow the same theme here, the reason why these two LRs specifically easy aid is because they are Majin Buu Saga related. So, if Global's going to get, you know, easy A's to take their place, then those characters would have to be in some way, shape, or form related to whatever the theme of the worldwide Dallas celebration is. These are three LRs that I picked that I think have a great chance of either getting a global first EZA or simply EZA during the worldwide download celebration. Let me know what you think. First one is LR Tech Broly. This is the one character I am looking forward to the most in terms of getting an EZA. And if he were to get an EZA, then worldwide could end up being, let's say, like a double Broly celebration. So Goku versus Broly in part two, maybe like. Goku versus Z Broly in part two and part one could be like, I don't know if they'd do like a standalone blue go. I don't know what they would do, right? Super Broly in part one, Z Broly in part two. It's just a concept. You can let me know what you think about that. I'm not too keen on that idea anymore simply because we do now have an anniversary character that is Broly, right? So I don't know how they, you know, navigate that. But that is definitely a possibility. As I already leaked here, another great opportunity uh, to get an EZA would be this Fusion Reborn Angel, Goku, and Vegeta who do fuse into Super Gogeta. So with these options here, we are already looking at some sort of movie celebration. And um, I'm not going to lie, you know, worldwide download celebration tends to be movie related, right? We had the Cooler and Carnival Goku. Actually, no, because last one was Future. What am I talking about? Yeah, so I don't know. I mean, it, it's it's definitely interesting. We don't know what, what's going to happen. And we don't really need it to be Fusion Reborn related for this character to get an EZA. We don't need it to be, you know, Broly related or any of the Broly movies related for this guy to get an EZA. As long as one of the villains is a, you know, honestly, as long as one of the villains fit any of these categories, which is definitely going to get buffed in some way, shape, or form, then... Uh, this guy does have a decent chance of getting an EZA. And same with Gogeta. And last but not least, this Janemba. He is a 2021 character, at least for JP. Released in 2022 for Global. But again, actually, yeah, Global. So this guy getting an EZA would definitely be an amazing buff to the... Oh, dude, both of these characters getting an EZA would be an amazing buff to the movie boss's team. Especially because now Broly is, sorry, this Super Broly is a thing. So um, I, I think if they're going to push and make that team a lot stronger, you know, easying these two, but specifically Janemba would be the way to go. So these are my top three picks. I don't think we're going to get all three. Is it possible that, J that Global doesn't get any exclusive EZA that is also very possible and probably most likely I just think that they're they have to sorry they don't have to I think that it isn't out of the realm of possibility for for global to get the same treatment that JP did in the sense that hey because look global has gotten many global first EZAs right I can automatic automatically sorry think back to uh lr into god goku which jp had to wait quite a bit for and they also had to wait quite a bit for the great ape ezas the str raditz physical uh kid goku and uh, was it the agl vegeta i think it was uh so we we have gotten many global first forms of content so this isn't out of like the park in terms of an idea like this isn't something that's like oh my god there's no way global gets this we we get many global first pieces of content so i think it's definitely possible i would not expect it i would not sit here and say it has to happen i would not go into the anniversary 100 believing this will happen because then you're just going to disappoint yourself i just think it's in, it's i think it's interesting to point out that jp got jp first content for a shared celebration happening a little bit later where Global can now have that same... Well, we are in the same boat, so why can't Global 
get global first content that we're going to end up sharing with that celebration just a little bit later. Uh, so yeah, let me know what you think. Hopefully you enjoyed. What LRs would you like to see get an easy eight first on global? What banners are you summoning on first for the anniversary? If there's any other pieces of anniversary content you want to see, let me know. I already have a bunch of things planned just for you. So I can't wait to share them with you. Hopefully you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Merry Christmas and good night.